Du, 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 du. Hello, Facebook, YouTube. Today I got some interesting messages today. God gave me, I have to do one of them. You know, I wish I could do all of them at the same time. But God, you know, when you're hearing from God, he it's a flow. God flows. You know, God doesn't really, you know, spot, 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 spot. But it's how much you can hear, have an ear to hear, you know. And God gave me an ear to hear, you know. But I got to bring the news from heaven to you. Now, I want to talk to you about, you know, the idea of because. <laughs> wow. Because. Now, because the song says, because he lives... I can face tomorrow. Now, it's important to understand because, you know, first, because be means exists, you know, to be, to exist in this earth. Now, watch this for what cause. Ha ha ha. For what cause? Now, we are, you know, we be in this world, and we're people are trying to find for what cause is the, you know, what when we come out of our mother's womb, you know, what I'm saying, is the, the 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 search or supposed to be the adventure of what we're supposed to seek after, but unfortunately. We come into a world that we don't understand the logistics of what what happened concerning the people that was more likely before you has established. You know what I'm saying? We don't know. We don't understand that a spiritual world exists and a natural world exists. But we see a natural world, but we're not so much aware of a spiritual world that existing, you know? And we like, hmm, what's going on here, you know? And unfortunately, this thing called, you know, sin and iniquity that is now born in us, according to, you know, Psalms 51 and 5, we're not aware of there's elements inside of us that can hinder our chance of discovering hell of the sir, how you doing? Can, can hinder our chances of figure out who we who we be you know that who we be for a cause you know what I'm saying and we're most people are don't understand that they're entering into a dark world you know the thing is I want to just say this I'm I'm a youth pastor and one thing that really I have a heart, utmost heart for the youth because I see what they are being placed in, more likely, because I learned, you know, God taught me, you know, the reality will reveal to me that everybody's placed in this world, but placed in what world, what kind of world, you know? They're not sure. They just, you know, place in here and say, what's going on here? I mean, really, a, when I see a baby, I can, you know, hear, you know, where am I? You know, where am I? What, what, I'm, what I'm doing here? How did I get here? You know, that's why I hear in a baby's heart. You know what I'm saying? And I'm hearing that in a baby's heart, and I'm seeing the world around me, and I'm like, oh, no, you know? And I'm like, whoa, what's going to happen here? You know, this is not a good picture here in a sense that just placed here. Then say, hey, you know, can I go to that place called Earth, you know, and go chill out and hang out there? You know, no, it's not that kind of situation. It's more likely, you know, the situation of, well, you know, uh oh, welcome to the jungle. <laughs> Welcome to the lions and tigers and bears. Welcome to this ferocious person that now Satan's men has submitted 
gave him power to Satan that's, you know, doing, the, you know, 2 Corinthians and 4 and 4, you know, the God of this world, you know, deceiving many, you know, got their eyes spiritually blind and stuff, and it's getting ugly. It's getting ugly, not getting better, but getting ugly in this place, you know, and that's what you got to tell, you know, help them realize that they were placed in this world, you know, for a purpose to do something. Now, I'm going to get back to because. Because is what we're, we're at. But the course, we, what we need to understand if because is going to, you know, happen, that we're going to exist for a cause, the only way that can ever happen that everybody must have to come to the understanding concerning the word of God is because he lives. Jesus Christ lives. I can face tomorrow. Now, there we go. I'm going to get on face tomorrow. Now, the thing is, the, mo the, the, two, the three senses that is upon a person's face is their eyes, their nose, and their mouth. And when we face something, what happens is we're seeing the, the, the number one, uh, you know, senses that, you know, responds quicker is the eye. You know, sent we see first. You know what I'm saying, and 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 and, and, and seeing we take in light, and nose we take in scent, but in mouth we can speak out. You know, it's a thing that we can speak out and recognize things. And the problem is, a lot of people don't understand when they face something. We take in things and we take in a lot of things and we don't realize what we're taking in that we can speak out. And y'all know the death and life and the power of the tongue, you know. And when we, you know, realize that we speak out certain things, you know, I mean, we take in and we seek out, we establishing what we're facing and what we're seeing and see and if things are difficult from our ability uh-oh fear sets in you know and the thing is we see fear we sense fear and we find ourselves speaking fear and that's not a good thing because that's what we will establish concerning a how what we face you know and the thing is, that's not good. But because he lives, he, Jesus, will help us to face tomorrow. But face tomorrow concerning faith. You know, that we start seeing with faith, smelling, sensing. Smell means like sensing faith. Sensing faithful people, sensing, mm, yeah, and speaking faith, you know, and that's what's important concerning you facing tomorrow. If you're facing tomorrow with fear, <laughs> ugly, things gonna turn out ugly. But if faith is the um, what you're sensing, you know, things gonna turn out beautiful. Now, watch this, regardless of what you're seeing. You know, regardless of how difficult things are, regardless of how, you know, things are easy, you know, you're going to face it, you know. <laughs> and the thing is, when we come to understand be existence for a cause, he lived, Jesus Christ that resurrected from the grave, that gave us the ability to now face tomorrow, that we can see our challenges and sense what we have to do and speak you know life to our situations we can handle situations accordingly and then life and life more abundantly can produce for doing that but you know what's going to happen when we 
you fear fear you know what i'm saying fear is going to you know you know take life and end up in death because the wages of sin is death but the gift of god is eternal life but i hope you understand this teaching and i hope this teaching reveals something to you of a reality to help you to you know do be you know exist for a cause that you know he jesus christ live now you can face anything that come your way anything that's circumstances whatever giants goliath that come in front of you you have a slingshot you know of the five rocks j-e-s-u-s -S, you know and you can be a david and have the boldness and stand upon the truth of god's word all right and conquer the giants that come in front of you all right to god be the glory to him forever and ever in jesus name amen